Not since Queen Victoria honoured Tunbridge Wells has an English town been given a royal title. This was one of the first times that the people of Wooden Bassett came out to honour the fallen. Four years ago, it was just a handful of residents. And look how it's grown. Come rain or shine, they have stood in their thousands alongside grieving families. And tomorrow they will do it again for the 157th time. I know the whole house who wish to join me in paying tribute to the people of Wooten Bassett. Their deeply moving and dignified demonstrations of respect and mourning have shown the deep bond between the public and our armed forces. On a high street that has seen so many tears, today's royal honour raised a smile. But the people of Wooten Bassett were still as dignified as ever. We've never sought to have any reward for what we're doing. Um, we do it purely because these lads and lasses have actually given their lives. They've paid the ultimate price and all we do is give a few minutes of our time just to stand and pay tribute to them. The official name change will happen later this year. At about the same time, RAF Lynham will close and repatriations will move elsewhere. John Kay, BBC News, in soon-to-be Royal Wooden Bassett.